Paladin, Enhance, Druid, Rest to Enhance, Hunter, Pharaoh, Warrior, Mistweaver, or Windwalker, another Windwalker, two Holy Paladins, a Druid, or not a Druid, a Death Knight, a Rogue, then you have Frost Mage, Rest to Shaman, Affliction Lock, Warrior, Rest to Druid, Affliction Lock, Enhancement Shaman, Red Paladin, Holy Paladin, Demon Hunter, Demon Hunter, Elemental, Rest to Shaman, Hunter, Discipline Priest, Shaman, De Death Knight, Demon Hunter, Hunter, Rest to Druid, another Elemental Shaman, Paladin, Paladin, Rest to Shaman, then you have a Warlock, a Warrior, a Frost Mage, another Warrior, a Shaman and then another Warrior, Priest, Druid, Shaman, Mistweaver, Warrior, Mistweaver, Warrior, Warrior, Holy Paladin, another Rogue, Shadow Priest, Discipline Priest, Warrior, Shaman, Warlock, Hunter, Priest, Warlock, Mistweaver, Death Knight, Mistweaver, Mistweaver, Shaman, Mistweaver, Red Paladin, Shaman, Warrior, Priest, Mage, Mage, Shaman, Warrior, Mage, Rogue, Mage, Rogue, Red, Boomkin, and then Mistweaver, Hunter, and Death Knight. So, but, by what we can see, is that Rogue is OP and War is meh. War is just good. Like, they're not great, just good. But there are three Rogues because it's the most broken class. There are literally more Red Paladins than Rogues. Yep. Just good. Yeah, they're okay. Where is where is they're okay? Not great. Okay. That's because rogues are so OP, dude. Look at those little rogues on the ladder. What a stupid logic, lol. You're right, dude. I agree with you. There are 30 warriors. So, uh, you know, rogue warriors are not even that good. Just because they're on top of the ladder doesn't mean anything. It's a proven fact that all the best players chose warriors and all the noobs picked other classes like rogues because they're invisible kids love playing rogues Are hunters broken too? No, they're good. <laughs> Rogue trap. Invisibility OP. You heard hunter as much or more than warrior? I mean, we can see how many hunters there are. We can do pp ladders and then you do filter by talent spec and then we do hunter and there are one two three four five six hunters in top 100 
and warrior 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 there are one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen fifteen warriors in top 100 What spec? BM. Uh, there's a bunch of uh, MMs too. Oh man, I should blind instantly. We could have killed if the if the druid was here, but he fucked off to heal, which is sad face. Oh yeah, I'm dead. This does like one million damage. Oh no, it doesn't. He hasn't stacked it yet. Still gonna kill me though. We could have killed if the druid kept doing damage. Sad pace, no space. That's 85 non warriors, that's true. No shadowlands, no damage, yep. Rogue Pharaoh seems good. Uh, I don't think so. As a rogue is better. Uh, it has better setups. I don't know by itself if it's, if it's better. Why Warrior is good in 3 3? Because it has broken damage and they're not really squishy. Like they can survive pretty well. Do you think Demon Hunters are balanced? I don't think their attacks should cleave. At least, at least make it so their attacks don't cleave for full damage. But apart from that, I me mean, yeah, they're okay. The shamans are not bad. Enhancement shaman is really broken, and resto shaman is really good. Enhancement shaman has insane heals. They're like a healer when they use their Maelstrom. They literally turn into a healer, if not better, because it's instant and it heals for the same amount as a healer. I'm dead. 